The threatened raids has many in the local immigrant community bracing for impact. Team 12's Mitch Carr has the story. I don't call them raids. I say they came in illegally and we're bringing them out legally. Friday, President Trump made his intentions clear and he even gave the country a timeline. ICE will seek to deport thousands starting Sunday in cities around the country. Phoenix is not on that list, but the immigrant community here is still on high alert. Arizona and Maricopa County in particular are no strangers to these raids. Our pile was out literally hunting our mothers, our fathers, our siblings, um, our children um, out in the streets of Maricopa County. Maria Castro with the Puente Human Rights Movement, which started as a response to Sheriff Joe Arpaio's controversial law enforcement methods, says her organization is preparing for the worst. The level of anxiety and trauma that is terrorizing our community definitely feels like something is about to destroy our livelihood. The local field office for Immigration and Customs Enforcement put out a statement saying in part, quote, as always, ICE prioritizes the arrest and removal of unlawfully present aliens who pose a threat to national security, public safety, and border security, end quote. Castro doesn't believe anyone should be deported. In fact, one of Puente's slogans is, not one more deportation. They want people to know that if ICE knocks on your door, first, don't open the door, and second, call Puente. We'll be able to send out a team to bear witness. You know, we need people to witness some of the atrocities that are happening in our communities. 